And welcome back. This is going to be exciting because we have seven animals to unbox. Ha ha ha! They are not fish and they are not reptiles. Hurrah! So I have seven little enclosures all set up. These are basic setups so that they can do their thing in here. I can make sure they're all eating because one of them is wild caught undescribed species. Who knows what it's going to be? Um, hopefully we can get another one, then we can breed them and generally have awesome things. So um, they are going to go in here. So I have seven enclosures set up for the seven new things. And then once they are settled in, eating and stuff, they're going to be moved over to this section, which is my giant wall. Hurrah! So let's go and unbox some excitement. <laughs> Oh, she's very fat and she's gone. <laughs> okay, there's no easy way to do this, so I'm kind of doing it one-handed. There is my paperwork, because all these spiders have to be on license. Wonderful stuff. Um, so let me see what it says in the paperwork. Uh, because there is an undescribed species, so I'm not too sure. Oh, there we go. So it just says eight tarantula Selenotypus and free tarantula flocus. That's easy. You don't have to put what type they are, just what they technically are. It's my invoicey thing. There's a card of the spider. Let's see what we have. There should be seven adults in here. Labeled is always good. Okay, we have species 2, a goliath, a goliath, an undescribed species, let's hope it doesn't bite, we have, these are all Australian spiders obviously because I'm in Australia, a species 5, a species 2, Another species too. Oh, it's little. Look how little it is. Uh, what's this one? Species four. They hopefully should all be girls. I've got a fair few girls in there somewhere. Actually, there is my 2006 spider. So how old does that make her? Mm. However, however old it is from 2006. There she is. She is out because, oh, and she's gone. Um, they are faster than they want to be. Oh, look, there she is. Oh, now she's gone. Yes. yes, they are. She was out. Oops, sorry, plant. Let me move the plant. Um, yeah, they were out because I had the lights off, but now I have the lights on. Fun stuff. Anyway, uh, and another species four. So we should have. Seven, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Nine? Okay, maybe. No, it should be eleven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Ah, uh, duh. Ten, species five. Uh, two point five. Well, I've kind of screwed up because I've only got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven enclosures ready. So we'll just make some more up tonight. Who needs to sleep? <laughs> uh, so yeah, so apparently I have 11, you spiders. It's a good thing the paperwork says 11. There we go, eight and three, definitely seven. Um, who shall we open first? I have no idea. I wanna open that one, but let's now. What I might have to do is cut, open, then check the spider out. This is dodgy. <laughs> I have my phone balancing there, but let's check out the spider. A little spider. So that is her there. So that is a species two, pretty sure that's species two. Species two, so she looks fine. Lovely spider. 
doesn't want to get off her moist paper towel. But we shall pop her in the thing. Let me pause. And back. And there she is there. So, she's feisty, not wanting to be picked up. There she is. That's a lovely spider. So she's only small. So we will get a cup and pop her in her thing, but she looks pretty much the same as the other species too. All around nice spider. These are native to, ooh, don't you run. Uh, native to far north Queensland and fast. So I must get her now. Pausing again. And we have her. <laughs> And she is going in this enclosure, so I will pause and go to the next spot. We're so high tech. <laughs> so this is the third species two. Let's hope she's not as fast as the last one. Probably is. Where is she? There she is. Looks the same size as the other ones. There she is. Hello. So they're pretty docile spiders. You still don't want to get bitten by them because they are venomous. Settle. Calm. Are we calm? We're calm. So I have my cup. No, well, it's not really a cup. It's close to being a cup. She's going to eat. There she is there. So in her enclosure, she will go. Pausing again. Then we're on to a different species. How exciting. Um, Goliath. So these are the Australian Goliaths. They are not, obviously, the American Goliath. Oh, that's a bit bigger. Can you see him? Can you? Well, he's a she. There's some big long legs. Spiders are not that scary, people. So these have got a decent look. Decent leg span for what they are. Look at that. That is a cool spider. So these are going in the quarantine tanks so I can fatten them up, make sure they're all good in that. That's a lot of legs. Trying to get the angle right is a bit hard. Oops. Don't drop. Yeah, they are delicate, so you don't want them to drop. That's why we have our lids. So, to the next one. And while everyone is sleeping, I'm opening tarantulas. <laughs> Jesus. So, it's another Goliath. Oh yeah, you're big. That is a decent sized spider. Look at that. If you can see that. That is a nice spider. So, hopefully not too fast. There they are, kind of fast. Well, she's docile enough, and if I can get her on the bed, what we might do is film her from another view. And there she is. What a lovely spider. So, yes, um, Phlogus, or whatever you want to pronounce them, have the bigger, longer front legs than the other tarantulas, they're Selenotypus. So you can sort of tell the difference with the big, long front legs. Hopefully she won't bolt, but if she does, she's not going to go far. Um, very cool spider. Venomous, but they're not going to kill you. Don't know about the um, that species there because it's undescribed, but these ones are not going to kill you. Um, they are pretty toxic to cats and dogs, so you don't want them near a cat or dog. If you're scared of spiders, there's not much to be scared of. They're like fluffy. Look, big fluff. Oh, we can focus. Oh, look at that. That's lovely. Look at your little spider bottom. Beauty spider eyes. There's probably spider fangs at the front. Tucked away. But we will pop her in her enclosure. And we might as well jump to the um, undescribed orange species. So this is the only one that's been found west of Cooktown, right up northern Australia. Let's hope it's not highly venomous and doesn't bite me. Ah, <laughs> uh, but. What can you do when you're having fun? Ooh, that is a cool spider. Look at that. Ooh, you're fast. You're fast. Stay there. 
nearly got me. Didn't quite. That is a fast spider. She's coming, she's coming back. Let's see if I can get her in the camera view. <laughs> she went that way. Going to lure her this way. I have her in a cup. She is very feisty. Okay, there she is. By orange, we're talking about brown because all spiders in Australia seem to be freaking brown. But she's definitely got a different colored brown to her. Um, let's hope we can get another one. Wow, she is a very cool looking spider. Um, I'm going to change the angle so you can see her from above and hope she won't run too far. I'm not worried about her biting me because she's not gonna bite because she's a spider, unless I try and squeeze her. But I don't want her to drop because that can damage them. And this is a freaking awesome spider. So let's switch the camera again. And you know she's just going to run as soon as I move this. There she is. Okay. Perfect bottom. That's a perfect spider bottom. So undescribed species. Don't know what it is. Um, the guy that I've got these spiders from, um, we've actually dealt with him for oh, 15 years or so. So he knows about spiders. So if it's undescribed, it's undescribed. Freaking awesome spider though. No idea how big it gets. It's not overly big, so maybe, oh, I don't even know, can't even work out the size of stuff. So, don't really want to put my hand next to her, because I don't want to spook her, but that's a hand, that's a spider. She's medium size. Look at that, she's just got a really nice pattern on the back of her. Probably about to shed. She'll probably shed and go black. <laughs> But at the moment, undescribed species, not a goliath. Yeah, look at the color. That is a pretty, pretty spider. He will figure out what she is, or if she doesn't have a name, he will sort it out with the Queensland Museum or whatever he does. Hopefully we can get another one and yeah, the same locality and do its thing. Look at her little leg up. She is not happy. She's like just going to bolt but we will pop her in her cup and pop her in her enclosure. That was an awesome spider. So, species five. I've got a couple of species fives here, so I'm only gonna open one because they're gonna look pretty much the same. There is a species five. So these are a lot stockier than the other ones. Come on, come out, come out. There's her legs. There she goes. There's her brown boots. See if we can ease her over. Come out so everyone can see you. She does not want to let go of the paper towel. So we don't. Okay, that might be a better angle so you can see her. So she is a species five. So again, far north Queensland, these are all Queensland spiders. See how she's got a lot shorter legs than the last species. Um, very stocky, very cool spiders. I think they run out of names for the species 4 and species 5 and 2s and 2.5s. But yeah, they're describing new species all the time. So that is a pretty spider. Probably more orange than the orange one. Okay, and we have a species 2, and then after this it's a species 2.5. So, ah. species 2? No, species 4. What am I talking about? This is a species 4. Wherever she is, there she is. I can see her bottom. Oh, she's only little. Oh, she's fat. Who is the fattest spider that's ever been? Look at her. So again, um, similar typus, so they have the little tiny legs. Pretty we can't focus. But yes, very small, very cute little spider. Let's check to see if the other one is any bigger. And this is the other species four. See, I remember. You can just see her little bit in there. Yeah, no. Oh, oh. oh, she's little as well. Little and fat. Check out her. Oh, watch out. Da -da. 
Jesus. <laughs> oh, she's got sharp, bloody claws. And she's fat. Or at least she didn't drop. Um, what I need is another thing to lure her into there. I'll use... See if we, we come prepared. We'll use our blunt end of our scissors. So that's the non-sharp end. There she is there. Look how fat you are. What did you eat, a mouse? But yes, that is a species four. So we've got a few species four. It's probably the... I just have to put my hand there so she doesn't fall. But yes, very cute spider. So next is a species 2.5. So I'll give you them. We'll get you in your thing. And we have the species 2.5. I'm not too sure how big she is, but we will find out in a second. Oh, she's big. That is a decent sized spider. There she is. Oh, look at her fluffy legs. There she goes. Oh, she's very fat and she's gone. <laughs> Come back over here. She's coming back. Oh. Don't fall. Don't fall. Don't fall. Don't fall. Don't fall. We should have had a cup ready. Problem is, some of them are too fast. There we go. So she's safe. No spiders were harmed. If you don't like spiders, you shouldn't be watching. <laughs> ah, so we will just change the camera angle and there she is from a lovely flattering angle that is the 2.5 look at her meaty back parts so she's pretty freaking fast so i don't want to pick her up and her to run up my arm and then drop so all around very cool spider so apparently they're guesstimated to be around three to four years old so they can live up to oh 1820 for a female so yeah, I've still got my 2006 Eunice up the top there. So what she acrasipede, so Flogus acrasipede. Um, yeah, they can live a long, long time. So, so these are all girls, hopefully. Pretty sure they are. You can tell by their bits underneath. But we're not checking out bits because it's a spider. But anyway, we will get her placed in her thingy and then we will jump to the next morning and see who has webbed up. Anyway, it is the next day, next morning, it's the morning. Um, a few of them have webbed up. I think that one, which is a Goliath, has decided to web up the front. Ugh! But that's all right, it'll web the whole thing, so we'll deal with that. There is a leg, leg spider leg, little tiny spider hoofs. Um, that one there is, oh, that's the orange one, otherwise known as brown. Um, undescribed species from far north Queensland. There it is. There's its little spider booty. Um, started to web there. I think that one there, which is a species five, has webbed in the corner. Um, these guns haven't yet. I think that is species two. I still need to put the labels on the tanks, but that is tonight's job because some of us have to go to work. Um, that one's webbed up a little bit. That one there has not webbed up anything. That is a Goliath. What are you doing? They don't jump, by the way. No, Goliath is not impressed. So, it's interesting that you can have two spiders that look the same, one webs up, one doesn't. Might just take them a few days to settle in. Humidity is fine in this room, it's nice and warm. What are you doing, Benji? What are you doing? Anyway, we will jump to tonight. And it is now tonight, and we have lots of web. Lots of web lots of web um, a few of them are out that is a goliath well that's the goliath that didn't web just before um, i have everything labeled now hoorah that is a species too get to see her beadiness such a lovely spider look at that so yes everyone is doing well someone has pooed on the front spiders do poo they have spider bottoms um, yes, there's another species 2 there. We have the species 4, species 4, species 5, species 2.5. Wow, exciting numbers. Anyway, thank you for watching. Hopefully you enjoyed spider stuff. If you like spiders, click the thumbs up. If you don't like spiders, click the thumbs up. <laughs> uh, 
what can we do um yes thank you for watching if you made it to the end you are awesome see you in the next video wow